Good Thursday morning, everyone. For WIS News 10, I'm Intisar Faulkner in our WIS First Alert News Center, bringing you what's new this morning. A couple of stories that we've been following this morning. Out of Sumter County, a search is now underway in Sumter for a man accused of committing several violent crimes. Take a look at your screen here. 22-year-old Tyreek Samuels faces six warrants for his arrest. Samuels is accused of a domestic violence incident where authorities say that he struck a victim before stealing several items. He has a criminal history following a prior arrest for kidnapping that happened back in 2021. If you see Samuels, please call authorities immediately. At any lab test now, we offer over 8,000 lab tests with confidential results. Private, affordable, and convenient. Choose your test. Choose your time. Get your answer. Call 803-769-8100 or go to anylabtestnow.com. Well, if you haven't made any lunch plans for today, we've got you covered. Happening later today, Drake's Duck Inn is officially reopening in downtown Columbia. The restaurant has been closed for a year as it's undergone a complete renovation and some upgrades. Drake's is famous for its cheeseburgers and fried chicken and other family favorites. The restaurant's been around for over 100 years here in the Midlands. The ceremony will take place today at 1030 at 1544 Main Street and WIS will be joining in in all the fun. And listen up Gamecock fans, today is the big day. USC men's basketball begin the NCAA tournament tonight against the Oregon Ducks. The Gamecocks hope to keep their momentum going during their historic season. If they win, head coach Lamont Paris will also be the third USC coach to win an NCAA tournament. This is Carolina's first appearance in the big dance since 2017. Coming in as the sixth seed, the team will take on the Oregon Ducks tonight at 4 p.m. on TNT. And you can keep up with the latest game information by heading to our website at wistv.com. That's where you can also find the latest news, weather, and traffic updates. Have a great Thursday.